my name is Shanna. Welcome to my channel if this is your first time here. Today we are going to be doing a video on Spooch music. So I just wanted to give a brief background before we jump into the video. Spooch is a Barbadian music genre developed in the 1960s primarily by Jackie Opal. Jackie Opal was a singer songwriter and apart from being instrumental in the development of Spooch he also was instrumental in the development of Blue Beat in Jamaica as well as reggae music and he knew Bob Marley. They were friends. So in 1971 Jackie tragically died and unfortunately it seemed as though the genre had died with him because it did not live on past the 70s but it's still with us today and there's still a lot of artists who sang Spooch who are very much with us and we want to celebrate them and celebrate Barbados. So we are back on track with our independence episodes. <laughs> if yes y'all didn't catch that, that was doing. So we always say, you know, Barbados is lacking in culture. We're lacking in our own, but we do have our own. And a great example of something that is truly Barbadian is Spooch music. So today we are going to be doing top 5 countdown, no I love a countdown, of my favorite Spooch songs. That is what you got to you got to Number 5 on the countdown, we are starting with Wendy Ali and which one, which one, which one? Have a thing about you. Let's just double this up. Have a thing about you are Stand By Love. Because I really like both of those songs. And my mother really likes Wendy Aline. I wonder if she's family. I think she's family to us. Don't let me say that though. Don't confirm what I'm saying. But I think she's supposed to be. And um, yeah. Have a thing about you is just like the ultimate song. Like when you're not a thought, like you're classy, but you still trying to, he's not getting a point in other suggestive ways. So you got to hint a little harder to so say, like, if you don't believe me, I'm going to show you how strong my love is. I have a thing about you. Have a thing about you, lovely. And if you don't believe me, I'm gonna show you how strong it is. All of this. All of this. Okay, just in case you didn't get that. And this time, my love is just, you know, true. But it's so groovy. And I love the harmonies in Stand by Love. Love them. Love them. Love them. Number four on the countdown is the durations too with drink milk. You got to see what you come here to do. You feel that you just watch your people door, the people party, and decide what you come to do while you there. Look around see what other people doing it. No! What you come here to do? You come here to drink milk? Actually, funny enough, I have no idea what is the next thing. If you come here to drink milk or you come here to walk. I have no idea. Rumba, bumbun. I sing, I sing all kinds of things when I'm singing this song. I mean, I guess I could have just asked somebody, but it's a lot more fun this way. <laughs> oh, you come here for bumba. You come here to drink milk. Oh, you come here for dumpster. You have it to what the Romans do. You have it to what the Romans No. Oh, you come here for Ramsda. You come here for drink milk. Oh, you come here for some flour. The next song, number three on my list, is Mike Thompson. Marry Me. I love this song. I feel like if um, it's one of the first songs that I recognize as being spooch outside of like Jackie Opal. Now obviously I can hear the beat but that I paid attention to then. 
that I said, oh, well, I like this song. And I think it's such a great thing. And, you know, a, a proclamation of love. It's so nice when you have that truly in a song. I'm like, yeah, man. When you come back, I like, of course, I will marry you. Probably not. But the point is that that's something that would make me think about it. If you wrote me that song and sang it. But no, that ship has sailed. When I come back, darling, say marry me. I wanna spend my life with you. Oh. For everyone to see. I'll marry you. It's a good song to let you know to step and do a partner dance with, like dance with a partner, not like dance with a partner, but dance with a partner. Good stuff. Number two on the count now is none other than Richard Stout with Vehicle. Now what I like about this song is most Booge songs have like the same speed, the same tempo, the same it sounds pretty much the same in terms of the arrangement, but not vehicle. Vehicle is like a blend between spooch and soul music. And it's just different. It just makes me want to dance. I actually would love to do a choreography to that. I need you, I want you, I really got to have you, child. We gotta give you the I love you. He sounds like a stalker, though. I'm a friendly man in a black sedan. I want you to hop inside my car. I need you. I want you, I got to, got to have you, child. Hmm. Number one on my list, of course, goes to the big man himself. Who's, where do I get these cliches from, guys? Help me. Number one is Jackie Opal with Crimea River. I was up in arms between Crimea River and No Good, but Crimea River, the passion in this song, the passion in all of his songs, who do Jackie wrong though, like who hurt you Jackie, who hurt you, I mean Crimea River, No Good, You Got To Pay, it's like a whole trilogy, like, except I don't know the love song part, I feel like if that part is missing. You got to go down on your knees to see the You got to go down on your knees and cry me a That has been my top five favorite school songs. Thank you so much for watching. Um, like, subscribe, and share. I'll see you next week. You got to go down on your knees and hurt yourself. Prove it. You got to break your heart. Like you broke my heart. Oh, maybe you will realize. Look at that whole passionate I am about this, though. That is why. That is why. You got to. You got to. You got to. The most ungrateful person I have ever met. Mm. Mm. Alone.
me? You got a wrong girl. You got a wrong suit, P. You got a crime.